the Monday morning, a frigid start to the morning, and we'll continue that way throughout the afternoon as we have wind chill warnings in pink and wind chill advisories in blue. Until noon today, frostbite is a concern, and you could get frostbite under 10 minutes to expose skin temperatures. Today's highs, you can see single digits and below zero for many areas, and tonight's low is getting even colder. You can see double digit below zero from Haver to Glasgow and Jordan, and with the feels like temperatures, it'll be feeling a lot colder than that. Now we look inside the forecast, you can see right now we have this frigid air associated with this deep trough of low pressure on top of us, but as Chinook winds move into the area tomorrow. We'll have a brief warm up as you can see Tuesday's high is above freezing for many areas, getting even into the 40s in Great Falls. But with these 20 to 30 mile per hour sustained winds throughout the day, that's going to blow around a lot of the snow we just got, and that's going to cause a concern. And blizzard conditions are possible tomorrow, as you can see, especially along the High Line. Blowing snow is going to be a concern and we'll keep you updated. Now we look at our next weather maker coming in. You can see more snow is on its way for Wednesday. You can see light to moderate snow will be expected Wednesday through Thursday morning. As you can see, here's our snow forecast through Thursday. I'm expecting one to three in Cup Bank in Great Falls in Helena, three to five in Haver and Lewistown, and one to three in Glasgow and Jordan. We'll keep you updated as we get closer to this next storm.